Hi guys, uh, this video is just going to show you, it's just to show you how the bike is coming along. It's actually coming along really nice and um, uh, hopefully on my next video I can have it completely done. But I think you're going to like the way it's coming along right now on this video. So I'm going to show you what I'm doing right now. Um, the front wheel over here, the axle, I'm going to end up cutting it. I don't like when they stick out that much. It actually doesn't look that good. So I might cut it over here, weld it, so weld something on this side, and then put a nut on the other side. This way the axle only comes out one way. Gas tank is on. Uh, my buddy over here, he's putting on the rear shocks. I, I had put on the rear shocks, but I didn't have the right bolts for it. So he's doing that now. And the rear bearings are ready to go on. And yeah, this thing is coming together nicely. Before I put the rest of the bike together, um... The bike is black and, and red, so what I want to do is I'm going to take this off and paint this red because the blue just looks awkward there. So this is how the cover came out. On my camera right now it shows orange. But it's not orange. It's actually fire red. But for you guys out there. I, I see some people on YouTube. They go to the extreme of using 400 sandpaper. Sometimes 600 sandpaper to get a good paint job. I never ever use anything higher than 120 grit sandpaper. And 120, even sometimes 100, I even go with 100, and look how awesome that turned out. Okay, I'm going to leave this video here, but I, w I just want to show you guys how the bike is coming along. Like, I don't have much room here in my basement, so this is actually how it's coming along, and I think it's coming along good I actually think it's coming along nice so what I need to do is I still need to put the handle grips on the brake grips brake handles um, 
What else do I need to do? I need to hook up the caliper. Brake caliper in the back and the brake caliper in the front. But this basically gives you a, a basic look of what it's going to look like. Anyway, you guys, thanks for watching this video. This, on the next video, what I want to do is I want to build my own fenders. For here. Fender for the front and a fender for the back. I think it'll bring the bike out even better. Um, and a couple of little other things I need to do. So on my next video, what I'll do is I'll have all that done. And weather permit, maybe I can take this thing for a ride. So, anyway, thanks for watching. And see you on the next video.